think we got a good one. Yep. ball and chain Carolina rig man that's it's just old school zoom lizard two and a half foot leader X point hook big floor carbon <clears throat> pretty pretty Lake Falcon fish and there's nothing fancy about Carolina rigging find a rough bottom and drag it back the thing to remember on Carolina rigging is your rod tip angle though you want to drag it you, you want that rod down and low so you can just drag that weight over every little bit so you can feel the rubble. If you're lifting it high, you're gonna miss a lot of bites and you can miss opportunities on fish. God, these things are so strong. Let's catch another one. You hear the term all the time, Carolina rig, and it's really a, a system, a system of uh, a lot of different parts. And I'm gonna demonstrate how I put one together. I'll take my line and, and I believe in fluorocarbon. I use the Vicious Elite Series fluorocarbon on this. And we're at Lake Falcon, so I've got 20 pound test. And I'm gonna use 20 for my leader and for my main line. But the first thing I do is I just tie my hook on. I'm using a round bin X point four alt hook. And on my leader, it's about two feet, two and a half feet. And I'll just cut the end off. I am a big fan of tungsten. Carolina rig, a lot of times I just use plain silver. I don't think color is that big of a deal. I also like to add beads when I'm using tungsten. and protects a knot. I like a six millimeter bead, the smaller one, near my weight, and then an eight down on my knot. So I've got two beads. So now I've got weight, two beads, then attach a, just a black swivel to this. And I think this is called a trilene knot. Two loops through, five around, back through the hole, back through the other hole. Wet it. And then attach the hook to the other end of the leader. Same thing. Fluorocarbon added with tungsten, graphite rods, man, you get the ultimate sensitivity on that. Now you just clean up all your tag ends, cut, cut, and that is a Carolina rig. You're ready to roll. When working a Carolina rig, always keep your rod parallel with the water. Keep it low, drag that weight, and then let the weight and the bead do all its work. Make it noise, and that way you can keep good bottom contact and you can feel what's going on. And then when you get a bite, reel down into the fish and pull. It's never a snap, it's a pull hook set. Keep the rod parallel, keep it low, pull into the fish, you'll catch a lot more on a Carolina rig. Not a giant, but a Carolina rig fish. I tell you, you can catch them big, you can catch them small, but you can just flat out catch a lot of fish on a Carolina rig. Everything that we've showed you today, it's all available at Tackle Warehouse. Zoom lizard, X point hook, vicious line, eye rods, loose reels, everything available at Tackle Warehouse. Tie your Carolina rig on, drag that thing around a little bit, and get ready. Catch a lot of fish. Ah! <laughs> you think they don't want it? Look at that. Yeah. Bandit 200, 300, 100, just a bandit.